Rebecca Hansen here at Lunatic Fringe and I'm going to show you tips on filling in eyebrows. Now when choosing a shade for brows, you're going to want to pick a color that's one shade lighter than your natural hair color. You don't ever want to do anything darker than that because it won't look very natural. And you always want to choose a shade that's a little bit more ashy because too much warmth in the brow doesn't look natural. So we're going to use a powder and a gel. Starting with the powder with an angled brush, We're going to start on the inner corners of the brow and work our way around the arch. And what you do is start applying to the natural shape of the brow, just lining it. Now if there's any areas that are a little bit sparse, you can just put a little bit of powder right there. You don't want to put too much because then it'll look unnatural, but just follow that natural arch of the brow. And then since we've already lined that top, we're going to do the same thing on the bottom and just line the outside of the brow, getting a little bit more powder and product on our brush. Switching brows here. Eyebrows are never identical. So it's okay if you feel like one is a little bit off than the other because naturally eyebrows are never the same. Just go ahead and fill it in just really lightly. And once your brow is complete, you can set it with a wax. So you're using the same brush and just kind of going over that way your eyebrow hairs won't go out of place. They'll stay there the whole day. Again, I'm Jack Hansen, and I just showed you how to fill in eyebrows.